so you have the time of two and a half months to prepare for your iat exam and this is a strategy video that you guys demanded for and at the end of the video i will be giving some important tips to make this strategy easier to apply watch till end let's start the video so this video will be divided into three parts and our basic assumption in this video is you have the time of two and half months only so we will be dividing this duration of time into three parts the first month second month and the last 15 days so remember that you have to be prepared at mid of the august even if the exam gets postponed then also be prepared at mid of the august so that after the postponement of the exam you will be able to revise whatever you have done and revision is the key to success in the competitive exams continuing with the strategy uh, in the first time of the month you have to brush up whatever you have done already okay so don't go for learning new things and learning new chapters try to brush up try to conclude whatever you have done in the past days okay so in the one month you have four weeks and you also have the four subjects in your ICER aptitude test so you have one week for your one subject so in case of biology and chemistry make the notes of important things make important diagrams charts and whatever you have to conclude the whatever strategy you use to conclude a chapter in a per particular subject in case of math and physics try to solve as many problem as you can on whatever you have studied before okay so again i am telling that don't go for new chapters make your own notes don't look for any others already prepared notes they are not as effective as your own notes okay keep diagrams charts formulae special cases in physics document them in one place these notes will be the most important assets of yourself before 10 days and 15 days of the exam so try to prepare them so the final message is conclude whatever you have studied in past days in the second part of our duration you have to solve as many question paper as you can uh, so go for je mains paper neat paper nest kvpy are important uh, and also the and of course the previous year question papers of iat you have to solve them but here is a plot while solving the question papers do, don't look for the correct answer look for the concept which is discussed in that question paper uh, that particular question so go to the your notes try to revise those exact concept thoroughly try to see other problems that you have already solved based on that concept so this will help you to understand that concept in many dimensions so while solving the question paper even if you get the wrong answer make note of that your mistakes are also important while solving you will remember more your mistakes than what you have studied directly just one thing don't repeat them again and again try to revise them try to revise those concepts and build up the base of the concept so that will and you will understand that concept from various dimensions so this is what you can do in your second part of the month and in the duration of these two months don't forget to make your own notes this is the most important thing note whatever you feel important note it down and compile it in one place this was the strategy of two months for those who have studied before these two but but what if someone has ruined the past thing so what you can do right now is go to the concept through the question papers so you can start solving question papers from the very beginning of these two months and while solving the question paper look at the concept go to the chapter go to the some youtube video or you can look at the explanation of that question and try to build that concept okay so there is no so if you start so if you want to start from beginning of mechanics and electrostatics that in two months it's not possible so go through the important questions i have discussed many things in this previous videos look at them look at the previous question papers and go through the go to the concepts through questions learning them directly at this time at this stage of the time it's not feasible okay don't go for that so time for some pro tips first tip as i always tell don't run behind completing the syllabus but have a strong grip whatever you have completed but remember 25% or 50% of the syllabus won't work you have to study at least 60 to 70% and make the grip on it the second tip while solving the question papers don't look for the correct or incorrect answer 
this is very very important okay after getting some wrong answers we get demoralized and don't want to look at that question paper again but don't get demoralized try to build that concept try to go deep in that concept and build it in various dimension third and the most important tip some resources to study okay first for physics is uh, pratip sir's channel second for the chemistry is alak sir's channel for biology it's neela ma'am's channel and for math as usual i am not a math student i haven't watched uh, any videos for it but uh, you can try the alak sir's content for this uh, i haven't tried it but you can surely give it a try uh, one thing i am not someone great to tell that this teacher is best and this is not so uh, i'm just recommending what i have used okay so if you want pyq papers you can check this video or if you have some doubts on answer you can check this video subscribe to the channel and keep hustling